Kroger Tender Ray Beef, no other beef so fresh can be so tender, presents Hearts in Harmony Transcribed. You know, over the holidays, you took extra special care in preparing meals. So your family naturally expects each dinner these days to be outstanding. But that's not a problem, really. You see, you can serve an outstanding meal anytime when you serve Kroger quality beef. Yes, just serve Kroger quality beef, and you'll find your meal has plenty of eye appeal and taste appeal for that family of yours. And when you visit your nearest Kroger store and buy Kroger quality beef, buy it with confidence, for it's the very best beef you can get right now. It's delicious, it's tender, it's juicy, and it's bound to be a wonderful treat for you and your family. Watch how delighted your folks are when they see what's on the menu, for beef is almost everybody's favorite meat. Yes, lady, you can be sure of delighting everybody when you serve your family's favorite cut of Kroger quality beef. Visit your Kroger store, step up to the counter, and ask for Kroger quality beef the way you like it best. And remember this, Kroger quality beef is the best beef you can get right now. Buy Kroger quality beef with confidence at your neighborhood Kroger store. And now, Hearts in Harmony. Today is the day when Paul Williams will find out whether or not the bank will make him the loan that he and Freddie need to repair and open his dairy farm. Penny is anxiously waiting word from him when the doorbell rings. Oh, hello, Johnny. Hello, Penny. Well, good morning. Sure you don't mind? You can ask the silliest questions sometimes. How's Alice? Uh, not good. Oh, I'm sorry. You're carrying a suitcase. Where are you going? Oh, not to Wayne City on business or into the country for a sleigh ride, Penny. The doctors have sent for me. I'm going to Arizona. Alice. Mm Mm-hmm. Alice. It's, uh, it's just about over, Penny. Oh, Johnny. Come on in, sit down. Yeah, yeah, I, uh, I think I will if, if you don't mind. If you say that again, I... Well, just don't say it, please. All right, I won't. Come on, sit down over here. Okay, can I get you some coffee? No, 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 thanks. I just had some at home. Uh, look, look, Penny, will you, uh... Will you do me a favor while I'm gone? You know I'll do anything I can. I know that. Look in the office once in a while and see that everything's all right, will you? Mm Mm-hmm. But I know everything will be all right. You just forget about the office. Well, I'm going to have to for a while. I phoned Jed this morning, and he said to close up the place if I had to, but I I don't want to do that. Oh, I'm sure it'll run without you for a while. Sure, why not? (laughs) That's the way to look at it. Johnny. Mm Mm-hmm. Isn't there any hope? Mm-mm. No. No, Penny, no, no but, hope. But do- doctors can be wrong. They admit it themselves, Johnny. Even the finest doctors in the world will tell you that they don't know everything about everything. Well, this... This isn't everything, Penny. This is just a case of a girl who... Well, a girl who can't get well. But maybe she can, Johnny. Oh, there have been amazing recoveries. You know that. Sure. Sure, Penny, I know that, and I'm, I'm not giving up hope. But I think it's better to look at the worst side of it. Then it, it won't be quite so bad when it happens. I, I mean, I mean, if, oh, if it happens. That's much better. John? Mm-hmm. Alice doesn't know, does she? No, no, that's the good part about it. She doesn't know anything anymore. Oh, I'm glad about that. Look, would you like someone to go with you? Would it help? No, 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 thanks, Penny. I, I appreciate the offer, but this is something I'd better do alone. There, there's no use in it. It isn't fair to ask someone else to go through this with me. Oh, I'd be awfully glad Yeah, to. I know you would, Penny, and I knew you'd suggest it, too. You'd never let a fellow down. But, well, I, I, I'd rather you wouldn't, that's all. All right, anything you say. And, and look, I, um... I won't be coming right back, whether it happens or not. Uh, Alice has some family in California, distant relatives. And, and they said they want me out there. 
I know Alice would want me to go. Oh, sure, of course. But but I'll be coming back after a while. Johnny, mm -hmm. you, you'll be staying away because of that house of yours, won't you? Well, uh, it, it does remind me of Alice all the time, but I can move things around. Why don't you plan on staying here when you first get back? Uh oh, oh, no, no, that's out. Why? Well, it, it just is. You know how this town loves to talk? You're right. And, uh... Anyhow, it may be just as you said. Things may be all right by the time I get to Arizona. Maybe maybe the doctors are all wrong. Now you're talking like the Johnny Keith I know. You mean the Johnny Keith you used to know? Still know. And uh, won't forget? Never. Penny, I don't know what I'd do without you. After all I've done to hurt you, you just won't change your mind about me, will you? Do you want me to? Whatever. Well, I won't. You can be sure of that. You're the only thing in the world I am sure of, Penny. This is no time to say that, but I, I'm thinking it, so it might just as well be oh, said. Let's not worry about what we say to each other, what we think about each other. Let's concentrate only on Alice's getting well. Oh, I've concentrated on that until my head aches. <laughs> well, I'll do the same until my head aches, and maybe it'll do some good. If good wishes can get her well, she'll, she'll be in the best of health one day. Well, she has the good wishes. Yeah, but let's face the fact, she has the good wishes. That's all. Oh, I, I'm not going to slip into the gloomy side of it again, don't worry. I just want to be able to take it when it comes. And, and what kind of a guy am I, anyhow, feeling sorry for myself? Alice is the no, one... No, that... Johnny, that's not true. You know, it may sound cruel and heartless in a way, but a lot older and wiser people than I'll tell you the same thing, Johnny. When death comes, it's much harder on those left behind. And that's the really sad part of it. Ask someone who knows a lot more about it than I do, you'll be told the same thing. Yeah. yeah I've heard that, Penny, and in a way, I think it's true, but... Well, it, it's Alice I'm thinking about most of all. Say, I, I don't have much time. I'd better get out of here. You, you're sure you don't want someone to go with you? Not me especially, but someone... No. No, no, Penny, thanks just the same. Just, just wish me luck, that's all. No, no, wish, wish Alice luck. She's the one who needs it. And deserves it. Hello? Hello, Miss Gibbs. Yes? This is Paul Williams. Hello, Mr. Williams. Did you get the loan? I don't know yet. I haven't seen Mr. Norris, but I'm going to in just a minute. I'm calling from the bank now. Oh, I see. Well, I certainly wish you a lot of luck. Thanks, but maybe I've had my good luck already. What do you mean? Well, you know that fellow was out to investigate my farm. <laughs> well, I don't know him, but you told me a man was out there. Well, I saw him just a couple of minutes ago, and he said Mr. Norris took the report to the board of directors yesterday. Yeah? And they liked it. Oh, good. That means you'll get the loan, then. Well, I don't know why not. I, as I understand it, all the bank wanted to know was that my farm was enough collateral to make the loan a good risk. And the board thought it was, hmm? Well, that's the way I understand it. Oh, I'm so glad. You think I'm not? Um, is Freddie there? No, he's at the office. His last day, though. I suppose starting tomorrow, he'll be out on the farm with you most of the time. He'd better be. He talked me into this. I'm not going to get stuck with all the work. <laughs> Mr. Williams, I don't think you're half as afraid of work as you claim. No? Just give me an excuse to loaf and you'll see. Oh, uh, by the way, tell Nora I shaved and wore my best suit and a clean shirt, too, <laughs> just as I promised All her. right, I'll tell it. Oh, look, will you call me as soon as you've seen Mr. Norris? I'll do better than that, Miss Gibbs. I'll come up to your house all right, and we'll celebrate. That'll be wonderful. I'll call... Oh, oh, I'll have to hang up this kid, Mr. Norris, motioning me to come into his office. Wish me luck. Oh, you know I do, Mr. Williams. I wish you all the luck in the world and all the money in that loan. As you know, it isn't a simple matter to borrow money, Mr. Williams. Sometimes it's a long, hard process. Yes, I realize that, Mr. Norris, but... Uh... The day before yesterday, as I promised I would, I sent an investigator to look over your property. Oh, he told me it was very satisfactory. It was, Mr. Williams. In fact, the report is amazing. I had no idea your farm was so large, or that there was such complete dairy equipment on the place. All I need is a herd and delivery truck or two, and I'll be ready to start in business. 
You will need customers, too, Mr. Williams. Oh, I've already started on that, too. I'll have several hundred customers before I'm in operation. Hmm, yes. Well, as you know, I uh, took the report to the board of directors yesterday. I'm not the last word in loans here, you know. The board actually grants the money. Yes, I know. The, uh, the board agreed to the loan? It did, sir. To the full amount? To the full amount. But... What, Mr. Norris? I'm afraid I have some bad news for you. I don't get the loan? No, I'm sorry to say you don't. And believe me, I hate to tell you this, because this bank would be happy to lend you the money. Your dairy is considered an excellent risk. Well, then why don't I get the loan? If everything's all right, why don't you give me the money? I don't understand this at all. Mr. Williams, you may not be fully aware of all the circumstances under which you are going into the dairy business. If you mean I'm not an experienced dairyman, I admit that, but it ought to be understood that the men I hire to operate my plant will have the proper know-how. That is understood, Mr. Williams. We don't think you're a fool. Hello, Miss Pierce. Mr. Williams, uh... Oh, you, you didn't get the loan, did you? I can tell by your face. No, I didn't, Miss Kiss. Awful. Come on in. Thanks. What was wrong? Didn't the bank think the dairy was a good risk? The bank thinks the dairy is an excellent risk, Miss Gibbs. I could get the money. All I asked for on that basis. Well, then why didn't the bank give you the money? For a reason that should make you angrier than you've ever been in your life. I don't think I'll ever stop boiling inside. What was the reason? Freddie Lang. Freddie? Well, what does Freddie have to do with it? The him? bank heard that Freddie and I were to be partners in this, and they investigated Freddie. Oh, I see. They told me some things I didn't know before, that Freddie has a police record. So, no loan. Yes, Freddie has a police record, but I don't see why that makes any difference. It doesn't to me, Miss Gibbs. I like that boy. I liked him before I knew anything about his past, and I like him now that I know it. But the bank. It does make a difference to the bank. As long as Freddie Lang is my partner, the bank will not grant that loan. So Freddie Lang's past is the reason the bank will not grant the loan. Will Paul Williams drop Freddie as his partner to get the money? And what effect will this news have on Freddie? Will this be the blow that returns Freddie to his old ways again? Be sure to listen to the next dramatic episode of Hearts in harmony. Ladies, here's something you ought to know about Kroger quality beef. It's the best beef that's available on today's market. You can buy this beef with confidence that it will be deliciously tender and brimming with flavorful rich juices. Get some, and then wait until the family of yours comes home and the aroma of superbly cooked Kroger quality beef greets them. Just watch their faces light up. Just watch the glowy mood it puts them in. Yes, Kroger quality beef can make your dinner a meal that's sure to please every member of the family. So don't delay. Visit your Kroger store and get deliciously tender, juicy Kroger quality beef. And remember, Kroger quality beef is beef you can buy with confidence because it's the very best beef you can buy today. Get Kroger quality beef at your Kroger store soon. Now your local announcer.